is Arika Misha and it's time to do some cooking. But right now I'm going to bake. I'm going to do a quick Marie Callender's Dutch apple pie. Marie Callender's Dutch apple pie. Let me show y'all. All right. Marie Callender's ready to bake. It's ready to bake y'all. And it is the Dutch apple pie. Oh, this going to be good. Look at that picture. Ooh, it better look like the picture, Marie. That's all I got to say. This pie better look just like this picture. That's what you got in the box, girl. I ain't never baked one of these before, but I want mine to look just like the picture when I open this box. So, let's see. You get the box open, y'all. Let's read the directions real quick, though. All right, preheat oven to 400. I've already got my oven preheated. Preheat oven to 400, move plastic wrapper from pie, set crumble topping aside on counter. How do you know I got a counter? Well, I think everybody got a counter, so. Okay, anyway. Uh, bake pie on baking sheet, center of the oven for 60 to 65 minutes. God, dog, this pie gonna take a whole hour. I'm glad I woke up early. Gee, whole hour? Uh, all right, remove the pie from one, uh, remove the pie from the oven, duh, uh, from the baking sheet, okay, never lift pie pan by the edge, okay, and then I got to put the crumble, so just crumble the toppings, uh, while still in the bag, okay, to the crumble size, sprinkle onto pie, starting at edge, and work towards the center, does it matter, okay, I'm gonna follow the instructions, y'all, okay, use a fork to evenly distribute the crumbs, Bake pie an additional 10 minutes. And then I got to bake it for 10 more minutes, Marie? Oh, no, Marie. Oh, crumb topping will bake to a rich golden brown. Handle carefully. It's hot. Duh. Telling y'all this is exactly what it says. Showing y'all. Let me see if y'all can see that. Y'all see it y'all selves. Okay. I got to bake it a whole 60 to 65 minutes. Put the crumbs on top and bake another 10 minutes. Good Lord Jesus. Be offense, Lord. Be offense. Be offense, Lord Jesus. Let me see. Let me get into this pie. All right. Okay. And it don't look as that big. This big old box. Ooh, Marie. Okay. These are the crumbs that go across the top. Okay. And you know, you got to smash them up a little bit because y'all see it's got like the big pieces. So you got to kind of crunch it up to your desired size. All right. Okay, look at the pie. Ooh. Oh, that look good now. I'm going to give you that, Marie. It look good. Now, Marie makes some good food, so. So, it should be all right, y'all. It's a cute pie. It'll fit right on my little, my little cooking sheet I got for it. It'll sit right on there. So that's moody. Let's sit our crumbs over here on the counter. All right, so, wait, do I supposed to remove this plastic? Wait, preheat oven, blah, 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 set crumbs on top of the counter, uh, bake pie on baking sheet in the center of the oven, remove, wait, okay, here it is, duh, remove plastic wrapper. Of course I'm removing the plastic wrapper, y'all. Come on, y'all know I'm professional. I am a professional. Professional. I've been cooking all my life. N not really. Not really. Did I tell y'all, I don't think I ever shared with y'all how I didn't always, I wasn't always a cook. I, I, that just came when I started having kids. Like, I was the one that never really cooked. <laughs> but once I started having kids, I realized that I had to learn how to cook to feed the churn. So that's, that's when I got into cooking. I was like, I got to feed my churn. Got to feed the kids, y'all. Feed the children. Word of the day. Take care of your children. Take care of these kids. Take care of your children. That's the word of the day. It's too much going on. Y'all better take care of these kids. Take care of these kids. Love your kids. Love the kids. The children are our future. They really is, y'all. Ain't trying to be all funny and stuff, but this how I look on the cooking sheet, y'all. I just got a simple cookie sheet. That's all. You don't, you don't need nothing fancy to just sit your pot on. So, I've already got the oven preheated to 400, and it's got to be in a whole 65, 60 to 65 minutes. I'm going to set my timer for an hour, and then I'm going to check on it, of course. And then y'all know we got to put the crumbs on top and bake it for another whole 10 minutes. So, 
let's go ahead. I mean, don't look too complicated. Everything already done for you pretty much. So, all right, let me go ahead and put it in the oven, y'all. And once again, this is the Marie Calendar. Marie Calendar. Marie got some good food now. I, I got to say that. Marie Calendar, ready to bake. I think I've cooked some of her stuff. I think I cooked some of her Popeyes on my channel. But she does have good good uh, food now, y'all. Uh, Dutch apple pie. That's the Marie Calendar Dutch apple pie. All right, so let me go ahead and get this thing in the oven for a whole hour. And then uh, I'll be back to show y'all what it's looking like. And then show y'all, you know, getting them bread, the, the little cookie crumbles. I don't know what this is, y'all. The little crumble crumbles that we're going to serve across the top. So let's go ahead. Let me get this in the oven, y'all. I'll be back with the pie. All right. I just took my Marie Callender's Dutch apple pie out the stove. And y'all, it looks really good. Marie, I'm going to give it to your girl. Shouts out to Marie Callender. Shouts out to my girl Marie. Marie, you did your thing on this pie. It smells so good, y'all. Ooh-wee! Now, see, you can leave it this way. You know, you can have it as a regular apple pie. You don't want to do the whole Dutch thing. But we love some Dutch apple pie. I usually get the Publix Dutch apple pie, but I said, no, no, no. No, today we're going to do Marie Calendar. We're going to make it like, you know, homemade. Like, I made it at home. I ain't really make it, but y'all know. Y'all know what I mean. All right, so we got our little, our little crumbs. We're going to go ahead and break them up to our desired size. I'm just going to crumble these things up and put them on top of this uh, pie chai. Ain't got time for all that. I don't want to break them up too much. Okay, okay. All right, that's good. All right, let me get this cut open. Now, we got to pour these over the top of the pie and put it back in the oven for 10 more minutes. Now, now Marie, I love your products, but I'm going to need you to work on that cooking time. A whole hour, Marie? And then I got to put it back in for 10 more minutes? Come on, Marie. Come on, Marie. You know we ain't got that kind of time now. You know we ain't got that kind of time in the kitchen. Uh, maybe, maybe sometimes. Ooh, y'all. Y'all see me dropping that on there? Ooh-wee. I am looking like Lagasse, Emerald Lagasse right now. Ooh-wee. Ooh, and Contessa. I like Contessa, too. I like Barefoot Contessa on the cooking channel. Shouts out to Barefoot Contessa. I love her. That lady be baking some good stuff. I think I've seen her bake a Dutch apple pie one time before. I don't think ain't nothing Contessa ain't cooked. But look, Contessa, why you always got to put wine in everything? I'm just, just curious, girl. You know. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. I'm just playing with, I'm just playing. I love uh, Contessa. I love her cooking channel. Yes. Oh, y'all, I'm doing this all professional. Y'all know I'm a professional. Y'all gonna put some respect on my name. All right, y'all, I'm just spreading it across like I know what I'm doing because I do and did <laughs> and do. Now, nah. all right, we're gonna put that on there, y'all. I think I'm gonna kind of like, I ain't gonna pack it, but I'm just gonna kind of like, you know kind of put it down a little bit but I don't want to put it down too far but that's cute y'all I did that yes I did I did y'all see how I did that y'all see y'all see how she ate that <laughs> I love that meme I love that meme y'all see how she ate that but all right y'all so y'all see I got my crumbs on the uh, Dutch apple pie I gotta put it back in the oven for 10 minutes and your girl will be back to show y'all now these crumbs are supposed to go brown Marie we're going to see when I pull it out in 10 minutes. Crumbs better be brown. All right. All right. I just took our Marie Calendar Dutch apple pie out of the oven. It's been about 10 minutes. And the, ooh, look at that. Look at that uh, apple pie juice just spilling out. Good Lord. Ooh, y'all know it's going to be good. And I got some vanilla ice cream to go with it. Yes. Got to have the vanilla ice cream to go with the Dutch apple pie. Mm -mm -mm. It ain't Dutch apple pie. You ain't got no vanilla ice cream to sit on the side of it. I'm telling y'all. Anyway. All right. Y'all seen me do it. So you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks guys. Bye.